You can't look me in the eyes. Afraid to make eye contact. Afraid that when I make contact, you might fuck around and get too high off my contact. Yeah. I can tell you don't want no smoke. Inhaling my paraphernalia might mess around and make you choke. Trust me. I get it. Because everything that I spit be the illest shit I ever spoke. So if you ever decide to use one of my lines, it'll be the illest shit you'll ever quote. I know. I wrote it. And I advise you to take notes. A requirement, not a request. The barrels to your mental, not to worry. I ain't pressed, but I am known to be kind of cocky. No cap. When I pop off, I can put tracks together better than bond and glue. But let me not confuse you. I do poetry and Scotty raps. But the crowd is guaranteed to do more than just snap. When I snap, last time I checked, you couldn't put me in a box. And body bags ain't come in my size, so tell your cheerleaders I'm collecting their pom-poms as my prize. Because I ain't your average chick. And never claim to be a bad bitch, but I'm bad, bitch. And for those of you who are just meeting my acquaintance, allow me to remind you what my name is. I am Lady 380, and whatever I speak is my truth. So if you find yourself offended or unable to relate, then these bullets weren't meant for you. I am a spoken assassin, so this is your final warning. I aim for straight headshots and ain't nobody in here bulletproof. All I ever wanted was equality. Now I'm fighting for my rights when she ain't got no right being in the position she was unqualified for. See, I open up those doors. Knock down those walls you had built up, took, you, took my key and inserted into the heart you had locked up. I broke those chains. But ever since I set you free, you've been running around off your leash thinking that a carbon copy of that key could possibly be on the same note as me. I hope you get played. Like a piano, I hope sis pops every string, takes you for everything that you own, including your soul, and leaves you crying out in a falsetto. Like black mothers cry out for their little black boys after losing them to a system designed to keep us behind. You ain't trapping, you trapped. And once they hide you behind bars, Scotty, that's a wrap. And they won't let us be great, but we still continue playing their games on uneven playing fields because we got to stand for something, so we kneel. And too many Indians and not enough chiefs that look like me, and if this is our land, then how come they keep getting home field advantage? Like, we can touch all the bases and still ain't guaranteed to make it home safely. Somebody need to body the umpire. Oh, hell. Uncle Sam for making it damn near impossible for us to make ends meet. Got us slowly meeting our ends. Where did we begin to go wrong? In this game of love and war, how dare you make me fight for the throne? Yeah. I am the heir, Jon Snow. You over there playing house, but I make you feel at home. I wanted to implant your chromosomes into my uterus. Create chocolate babies from uterus that look like you and act like us. Walk down the aisle in front of friends and family, but for me, I guess that just would have been having a dream, and no disrespect to Dr. Martin Luther King, but we gotta stay woke. They are dethroning our kings, putting more pressure on our queens by removing the fathers from the home. Forcing the mothers to raise the babies all alone or with minimum help, making minimum wage, trying to make it up a ladder that was never intended for us to climb. All because they tell us that the sky is the limit, but no one bothered to mention that they put caps on those ceilings. See, they give us the game, they just never taught us how to play. Like they say, women supposed to be in the kitchen because that's where they belong. And some of us women will go our entire lives trying to prove men wrong when in fact, we're supposed to provide the nutrients that they lack. 
they put us in projects with a government high scientists to run tests and experiments so if you don't die from the vaccine shots, you can body a couple of bullets from a couple of glocks off the hip of a cop. It's evident my complexion has you with an inferiority disorder. Divide and conquer is your motive, but look how close to us they've gotten. Now we all just a bunch of bad apples trying not to spoil rotten while they keep the soil fertilized in our blood. How much should I bleed for you? Before these open wounds become infected and being stuck in survival mode forces me to be just like you. And to think, all I ever wanted was equality. I wanted you to treat her like you treat me or at least do her like you do me. Not realizing that the best part about my DNA is that we are not the same. She ain't me and they ain't us. So instead of just taking pics, we got to start listening up and taking action because the revolution will be televised. We just got to learn to filter out the distraction. Lady 380. Try swing on me, make it worth it. 
Cause every man ain't the turn of the cheeky type. You and me, we gon' need to fight. Bitch, I'ma slap the shit out you with this level and give your ass an equal right. Cause I'll be damned if I have some bitches telling me my position. I'ma fuck the tech ass to cook me some of that tissue. Bitch, can you get some yams and smother my chicken? And when I finish, I'ma tell you go do some with them dishes. All that shivery is dead, I ain't tryna hear that nigga. Cause a shivery dad, you bitches killed that nigga. Uh, hey, uh, I know, I wrote it. Ain't something. Uh,